Jackie and I love magic and welcome back to a new video on my channel. Today we're going to make something in the kitchen as you can see. We are going to make a checkered board made from chocolate. Now I've seen this mold laying around in my kitchen and I thought oh my goodness this reminds me of Harry Potter. I have to do something with this so I came up with the idea to make the checkered board out of chocolate like all of it, the checkers board, the checkers, like oh my goodness, I can't wait! It's super easy and simple to make, all you're going to need is this mold or something that looks like this. You're also going to need white chocolate and some dark chocolate. You can also use milk chocolate, I think I prefer uh, the dark chocolate because it's more like the white and black. Let's go, do this! Hey hey, yes it's me, I'm voice overing this video! So the first thing you want to do is break up your chocolate and put it in a pan. It should look something like this when you're finished. Take a bigger pot and put it on the stove. Fill it up with hot boiled water. And when you're finished you can put your pot with chocolate inside of this one. Mix it up. And when it's all melted it looks like this. Now take your mold, and this is going to be very messy, but you want to put your chocolate on top of the mold and try in any way, however you want to put the chocolate inside of it, because this is so messy guys, but just do what is the easiest for you. around 30 to 45 minutes to cool down. With the rest of your chocolate you want to make a really big chocolate kind of plate thingy that you can use to make the squares of. Just spread as much of your chocolate on the baking paper and spread it out with your spatula. chocolate melt put it in the molds put it in the fridge and spread the rest of your white chocolate on a baking paper This is the hard part because you have to make squares. I made squares of 2 by 2 centimeters. Do whatever is the best and easiest way for you. This I have to say was very difficult. The best thing I think you can do is get an like ice squares tray and put chocolate inside of that but I didn't have it so I did it this way. Just make squares as many as you can. squares you can make your checkerboard just place them next to each other and make the size you want when you're happy with your result take some chocolate I chose some milk chocolate and put it on top or actually the bottom of the checkerboard and put it in the fridge for another 30 minutes. Now this is optional but I chose to put it inside a pie tray and put some more milk chocolate on top of it, spread it out, put it in the fridge to make it a bit more neat. Here you have your Harry Potter inspired 
chocolate checkers board. I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you're going to make this yourself, please send me pictures or videos on my Twitter, Instagram, Facebook. All the links are down below in the description box. Please subscribe if you haven't yet. I would really appreciate it. Thank you so much for the support. Let me know in the comments below what video you would like to see on this channel next week and I'll try to make it happen. Thank you so much for watching. Bye!